A dogfight ends with one animal shot and killed on a local trail. Park visitors are rattled and prosecutors are investigating criminal charges. Channel 3's Dave Summers tells us what happened. Last Saturday, Tom Sayers took full advantage of the warm weather and sought the peaceful trappings of Tyler Park and Rocky River Reservation to play his guitar. I heard dogs barking, I looked up, and the next thing I know, shots were fired. Some 50 yards from Sayers, a man walking his chocolate lab puppy shot and killed an attacking Rottweiler. He was legally carrying that firearm. Metro Parks Lieutenant Terry Burnett says the gunman had a carry concealed license for the 45 caliber semi-automatic handgun he holstered, along with 34 rounds of ammunition. According to him, he was in fear of his him being harmed and his dog being harmed. Investigators say the Rottweiler was off its leash, chasing wildlife, while the lab was tethered. Uh, he's a lab puppy, uh, about medium size, a uh, few months old, and uh, he just had a couple of marks on the side of his head, a little bit of blood there. The attack is disturbing to dog owners who frequent the metro parks. While disagreements among animals do happen, it's the first time one was settled with a gun. Sayers is a dog lover, but the idea of discharging a gun in the metro parks is most unnerving. I was extremely uh, shocked that somebody would be carrying a firearm in the Cleveland Metro Parks. After this incident, Sayers says he might be singing a different tune about the tranquility of the Metro Parks. In Rocky River, Dave Summers, Channel 3 News. A special prosecutor for the Metro Parks is expected to determine whether criminal charges will be filed on Monday.